Hello everyone, it's USA Monkey, and I'm going to show you all the real way to warm up for Call of Duty, for multiplayer, or Warzone, or whatever FPS shooter you're working on, and that's to shoot bots. Honestly, it's the best way to warm up, and the only really way you're going to get good. There's no tips and tricks. So we're going to go straight into multiplayer. Now that we're in multiplayer, we're going to go straight to a private match. Uh, we want to work with bots, and the reason why we work with bots is because they don't really shoot us back. You want to create a game mode, so I'm going to go to game setup and choose a map that's relatively small. I like to go to rest just to keep the nostalgia, but it's a pretty small map and it has long range and short range, pretty open and everything. It's going to be really effective for warming up. So game mode, I choose free for all just so it's just me versus all the bots. We're going to put 11 bots and put them on recruit. We want them really firing back at us and we want to get our confidence, confidence up before we go into a match. Game rules, score limit, I keep it relatively high, 100. I probably kill maybe 100 to 500 bots a day, uh, depending on how I want to work it. But we put score limit to 100, time unlimited, uh, radar always on. So right here, radar is always constant. And then field goal upgrade, I just change it really high so I can keep getting ammo. And I turn kill streaks off because my friends like to join and, you know, use their VTOL jet and stuff, so turn all that stuff off. Now for weapon choice, choose something that you're going to use in Warzone or multiplayer, something relatively close to what you're going to be using. Uh, say this is my overkill class, I'm going to use MP5, M4, kind of keep it with the meta. You want to use those two classes because you're going to get used to those two guns uh, in your practice, so when you go into Warzone, you already have the feel for those two weapons. Say I use the M Say I use the M4, but then I go use my AK loadout. The recoil pattern is going to be different, and I'm not going to be used to the AK. So stay relatively close to the guns that you're going to be using. If you're going to use snipers. You can practice sniping. So I have all your classes set up to what you're going to use to practice in a real-world situation. First thing you do before you start killing bots is turn aim assist off. And the reason why we do this is we make these small micro adjustments without the aim assist. So if I were to aim on this guy with aim assist and I'm slightly to the right, the aim assist adjusts for it and does half the work for me. We don't want it to do half the work. We want to do all the work. We do all the work. We don't rely on aim assist. You can track the bots if that's what you feel like doing, or you can start killing them. I have not started warming up yet, so I am going to kill most of the bots and then show you the difference versus me in the beginning and then me at the end of this 100 bot warm up. Alright, now that you warmed up a little bit, I killed about 60 bots uh, here. 
now that you're kind of warmed up a little bit, you got the aim assist going. I recommend going through all 100 bots before you turn aim assist back on. But now you can see the difference when you go, I put standard aim assist, but then it literally feels like aim bot. You can feel the grab of the aim assist. You can feel the difference. I'm getting worked by these bots, but it doesn't matter. I can start going for headshots only. You can see just a little bit of practice. I'm able to just, you see the difference. Literally got aimbot going on here. Headshot only. And this is just practicing without aim assist. And that's pretty much how you warm up for your Warzone matches or your multiplayer matches. Literally just kill bots. This is literally the most effective way of getting better. If you do this before every time you get on, it's just muscle memory. You're going to get better and better the more and more bots you kill without aim assist. Your aim is going to get super good. Your movement is going to get better just because you're killing bots and you're going to try to avoid them shooting you. So all that's going to get better over time. You can't just get better in a week. It takes time. You got to keep killing the bots over and over and over again. And it's just muscle repetitiveness, muscle memory. Killing these bots will get you better in your aim and your movement. Just do this before every match and you will get better. I hope you enjoyed this video. Like comment and subscribe if you think I can improve on anything, give you all more tips on whatever you want, whatever game, Warzone, multiplayer, just let me know. But I hope you all enjoy and maybe you all can try this to get better. And get those high kill games, get those dubs, enjoy, have fun with it, get better, practice.